for it. Uh, let's see. I don't think I need to, to even attach any energies to this guy. I can just hold my hand right now. Get to work. All right. Oh, we... I don't have psychic weakness to that guy, luckily. Here we go. Crisis drive against a poor Hitmonchan. 300 damage due to weakness. Well, hello, Nogros and the Frenchels. It's Dom. Welcome back to my kitchen. Man, on this menu, I'll be serving you Prism Star Giardina. This is the final Prism Star of the expansion that we have not covered. So, let's try to get some value of you. Prism Star Giardina, what's great about you? Hey, man, look at these stats. Uh, for basic, that's not a GX. This is above average stats. It's coming at the stage 2 level. This is what you would get if you evolve a Pokemon all the way for non GX. So, yeah, you can only have one of these. Better than average stats, but only really fits in one deck Metagross. Yeah, so, we're gonna make this work. I'm gonna explain to you. And although you already see the combo already, I'm gonna explain to you how this Prism Star Giratina works, and you're gonna see it in use. In three. Three what? Three awesome matches. So, first match, which is why I think is the best, combat wise, we're gonna go against God of War GX. Then, second, Giratina is gonna have his way down. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be his match. And we'll leave a really hard one for the end. Okay, so, let's get started. Today's intro! I'll give you a hint. The meaning of the song means every day, day in, day out. That's a good enough hint. So, let's, uh, it's a new one, so let us get started. Giratina, let us talk about you! What's his deal? He's in a rush. He's in a big hurry. So, let's go through a basic. Yeah, I don't got time to evolve. I gotta, you know, get in the fight right away. So with a basic, he's coming out 160. You can only have one of them for this much hit points. Yeah, that's why, you know, you're getting some very, very good value here. Banana Master's like, whoa. He has actually 40 more hit points than me. That's a 33% increase. Yep, but you can only have one. Only one. So, uh, first ability. Well, he's in a hurry. He's like, he needs energies quickly. So, if you're holding up to three energies, well, the ability is that if you're holding two psychic energies in your hand, you have to be holding them. They can't be in your deck or anywhere. That's the trick. You, when you play Giratina onto the bench, those energies can be attached immediately, and it does not count towards your energy limit. So, say you're holding the two of them, Play Giratina, play a draw supporter, such as, say, Professor Sycamore, for example, or Cynthia. Cynthia. Then find that last energy, attach it to Giratina. Three energies, almost ready to go. Like I said, he is in a hurry. So, by the next turn, yeah, you'll get that four energies to go. Wow, expensive attack. It is only attack. Crisis Drive. 160 enough to KO himself. But not most GX Pokemons. He's gonna need a little bit of help. You got to wear, give him the uh, go headband. And once he's wearing the headband, he'll feel oh, powerful, mighty, and he'll get a KO on basic GX Pokemons. Yeah, such as Necrozma. It does 190, so it can even hit Buzzwall without weakness damage. And yeah, Hobo. Basically, most of the basic GX you come across with will be taken down one shot. Pretty good trade that he's won Prize Guard. Here's the catch. You know, all that hurry, that, you know, the rush. One hot sh uh, one shot kills are gated. And this one's gated by a two energy cost. Big activation, two energy discard every single attack. You attack one, two energy discarded. Twice, four energies. Okay, it can add up pretty quickly, but if you do get GX KOs with them, it is absolutely worth it absolutely worth the trade but you need some energy management so we're gonna get the best battery out there who is it metagross it's like, yeah wait you're not using me to fight yeah i will i will but you're gonna help our battery you know he's just a bait he's only worth one prize guard so we send him in take a gx card and then you switch it so, okay okay back to the battery thing geotech systems once during your turn if there's a psychic or metal two choices energy in your discard you attach it to the active. 
So with one Metagross out, you just need to pay one energy. Now you can attack every turn! Two Metagross, free. Keep attacking as long as he stays alive. Yeah, that's why he is like the best combo with this card. And so what else he do? Oh, he's a stage two. That Giratina would be in a hurry, but he's like, I'll take my time. But he's worth it. 250 hit points, mainly because of ability. But he also has the highest hit point, base hit points in the game. So he's not gonna die in one shot. Very, very highly, lightly low uh, instant kill rate. And let's see, I can attack too. Giga Hammer, 150. He can't attack again, but you know a little trick, right? He just retreats, uses uh, all the Metagrosses, use their abilities, switch in another Metagross, and they're able to attack. That's the trick. Yeah, they just keep retreating, retreating to remove the effect, and use Geotech to just refill the energies. Yeah, so 150 is not enough to KO GX, but with the Choice Man, it is enough. Speaking of which, he will never be able to one-shot a Giratina because it's not a GX, so... Huh, that 160 is special, isn't this? So 180? Oh, you can KO uh, Lele, Guzma now. You can KO... Mmm, I wouldn't say a basic, most basic. A lot of basics are now out of range. Guzma, ho -Oh, 190, ugh, so... A certain basic GXs. And he also has got a nice GX of his own. Yeah, an algorithm GX. You get five cards from your deck, but you choose all five. So, this could be like rare candies. This could be Metagross. As long as your opponent doesn't end your hand away, which is good now. And this being less played because there's a better, really, really good card that's kind of taking a space. Cynthia. Yeah. So it's a little bit safer for Metagross to play now because your opponent won't be shuffling your hand as much. Because, yeah, new, uh, new good draw supporter kind of comes with that. Okay, what else? What else? I think those are... Oh, we have two big cards. We have one Necrozma GX. Why is he here? He's like, well, you can only have one Giardina, but you can also have the generic version. Generic? What? You call me generic? I'm more powerful than that guy. Look at me. GX 180. I got more hit points. But you get the two prize cards. Well, I'm a GX, you know, I'm a legendary. Well, so we'll see. Okay, so I'm done comparing. Let's go. Abilities. Lights in. In this meta, it's not as good. It prevents all damage from enemy colorless Pokemons. Those white Pokemons. So Banana Mask is going to be pretty sad when it comes out. I was like, ah, I can't KO it. But, you know, you're not supposed to fight with this guy. And it's not colorless meta, so thank Buzz well for that. Moving on. Prismatic Burst. This got all energies. Wait, how much? All Psychic Energies does 60 damage each one you discard. So a 3 Psychic Energy is 190, enough to KO most basic GX Pokemons. Load up a Choice Man, one shot KO. So if you have a whole set of Metagross team set up, he is gonna go to town. He will just one shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. It's like, take that, Giratina! I can do more damage than you! It's like, well, he's only worth one prize guard, so we're just you know, he's the throwaway card for, uh, to get that prize advantage. Well, he's worth two. That's the big thing. You also have Black Ray GX, where if you didn't have to use your, uh, you had a nice setup, you didn't have to use Algorithm. Great! You're gonna hurt all GX Pokemons, all the bad ones. Your ones are safe, just careful there. 100 damage to everybody! Yeah, so... Well, all the bad ones. So, what does that do? If all the bad GX and the X Pokemons take 100 damage, pretty much any attack you send out will destroy him. Yeah, that now, his move is a one-shot. His move is a one-shot. Heck, even Tapu Coconut Master can go off and get one-shotted. Yeah, so... Nice, good asset to your uh, Metagross deck. Finally, we have Mew for energies, which you should be down there too. You need energies quickly? Yeah, Shiny Mew could help you out. Got plenty of Psychic Energies. You find any two energy cards. This time we just have Psychic Metal and put them onto your Pokemon. So, that means you can charge this up quickly. Charge this up. It's a nice backup if you can't set up your Metagross or something happened to them. Some stinky trash monster shutting down our abilities. You have a little side grade and it's good for starting out. It's got a nice free retreat too, but it really hates Buzzwell. Buzzwell's like, oh, that's a free prize card. Ah, <sighs> Buzzwall, Buzzwall. We'll hunt you down, Buzzwalls, and you Zoroarks. So, those are our core Pokemons. The rest, trainers. 
you know, our draw supporters, our islands, I've tuned them. Is there anything that's really special beyond what you see in most decks? Okay, there are about maybe three special cards that you don't normally see. One is Heavy Ball. What? Why? It helps me land to buy Metagross. It's a little bit easier. And let's see. It, yeah, helps me land on Matang and these two big core components. It might be a better deck thinner though. I did run something with the... We'll see about that, but this is a special deck thinner for this case. Let's see that we have Sophocles. Why? Why would you want to discard two of your cards? At the start of the game, I really want my energies in a discard. So Geotech can start providing me those bonus energies when I need it. So with one Sophocles and some Sycamores, it's a more controlled way to maybe keep the cards you really want and discard some energies at the same time. So that's a small combo changer there. And Skyla. Yeah, you find an item, one item card, you don't pick a supporter even though you can, which is usually a rare candy and just helps your Metagross to set up. Alright, so, basically, it's another rare candy. It's a fifth rare candy. But it can be c called out through, say, Coconut Master. Okay, so, that is it. The big combo, you provide energies with this card, and they will use it up. And you can just fight with this card, too. Alright, that is it. Matches? Alright, if you're still listening here... Yeah, do people get to this point? Okay. First match is going to be the best match. Second match, Giratina's Day. I'll leave the third one to you. That is it. Let's get started. Alrighty. It's the Necrozma Sogaleo. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's see if we can take this. Let's get started. Welcome to another Metagross. I suppose kind of a Giratina match. Oh. Oh, I pulled the wrong card. Ah, uh, nope, 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 nope. Just leave it be. Just leave it be. So, welcome to another Giratina Metagross deck match. I'm gonna play my remix. We need some music. Hint. Two girls. Apocalyptic era. Kind of creepy. Kind of not. And, and a bit of endearing. That's, I guess, enough hints for uh, the anime opening premises of this uh, new remix. So, let's go. Now. Here we go, Lele into Bridget. There is that Magnemite ready to go. Mm, you know, let's see, a Smith Sogaleo, that uh, baby Necrozma Sogaleo. There we go. Has very, very, very high damage. He'll be one by one shot. Me, one of my Pokemons with a GX. Gotta be a little bit careful. That Meteor Tempest needs that choice band. And let's see, we don't have his resistance against my Metal, metal Necrozma, so a little bit tricky there. All right. Drop a float stone down for thinning purposes. I might be able to get this out. We'll see what we'll charge up here. Okay. Well, that's what you get. That's what you get. Here we go, Metang. Let's go ahead and try to get this evolved and put energy on this. And that is a uh, yeah, yeah. You're gonna have one of these. I'll end my turn right there. I need a set of more Metagrosses. Uh, let's see. Dust main, unfortunately. We just had to get all the decks with the uh, resistance, so I won't be able to one shot with Giratina. That's fine. We'll just have, you know leave it be. Hopefully we can just set up in time. We'll definitely have one Metagross ready to go. He'll be ready to attack to go too. But we need like 10 damage on it to get a KO on this. 10 damage somewhere, like even from Beldum. Yeah, we can do that. But you know, every Beldum you don't have is uh, you lose is one that's not giving you energy in the late turn. So, all right, now what? Sushi Master's right up front. He'll be back. Hey, wait, wait. I'm the Master Chef. I cook better stuff, way better stuff than Banana Master. Three cards. How do you think about that, Banana Master? I wish I went through training. Good stuff. Rare candy. That's up. Can we one-shot that? Uh, it still has resistance against all my psychic tech. I hope this can one-shot that, though. Alright, so we gotta be a little bit careful. Hopefully he doesn't have a choice man on here. And we're gonna have to, ch if this is taken out, then that's gonna be good. Now this does actually help me because I want them in the discard. They go directly to my Pokemon, which is great. Uh, I, I could try to get my Necrozma out, regular Necrozma, GX this whole line, it'd be pretty nice. All right, three energies, he's just waiting to retreat and then just blow up my Giratina, which, well, I have to leave it be. 
All right, let's uh, let's use the rare candy because it's much harder to do that to evolve this if I just you know drop this on right there a little bit better value. Banana Master is like, well, bananas are good. I like bananas. Thank you, Sushi Master. Another one of these guys right here. Let's go ahead and play this. I could take out. I'm afraid of the GX right now, so I can't do. Uh, I can't be uh, too aggressive. Rescue Dredger. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Put this from my discard to my hand. Two Metagrosses up. You want some psychic energies there? Hmm. I think I have a better idea. We should wait this for the next Metagross. We'll save for the next Metagross, or just hold for a bit. I'm not sure. All right, we're gonna hold this. We're not gonna remove the stadium just yet. I need to wait till the right moment. I'm gonna save this for the fourth Metagross. I could potentially start trying to charge up, get a quick Necrozma out, but I could always do that next turn. Let's just leave it be. Let's just leave it be. Ultra Ball. You see, there's a worthless Bridget right now. If yeah, you can. We'll discard that, and we'll see what happens. Four energies, ready to attack for 220 damage. Two removal? Mm, let's see, what is he afraid of? Okay, preventing retreat. I just need one float stone. I was more afraid of him losing the float stone because, you know, then I would be, whatever Pokemon I send out would be stuck up there. And uh, right now, I want to be able to retreat because I can Ultra Ball, maybe Necrozma, get a one shot in this, do something in that spectacular so let's see more energies is starting up for dialga which is weak to fairies spreading a love all around we're just waiting to guzma that out i just finished it off so abyssal hand all right we could we could guzma this out too yeah i want him to take the first hit so i don't have to worry about his gx let's see if i use the cross with gx that'd be pretty cool Everything will be pretty wounded, then Metagross will be like, yeah, it's all good. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to drop, we can't drop our last float stone. We can drop a Bridget, though. We can get our, our uh, another Metagross up, because they are pretty important to the combo. This time, uh, he made two removes that, you know, I may need a retreat one day. We're not gonna thin. So, Banana Master, what, one card? Please give me one more card. Yeah. Actually, you gotta retreat from my Necrozma if he shows up. This... Nah, let's go ahead and Cynthia. I don't want to give him uh, a little bit extra help here. There we go. Necrozma decides to show up now. Well, let's see. Nest Ball, you're there. Perfect. All right, energy right here. Geo tech. Start getting it. Doesn't matter if the last energy is the psychic or not, because the GX doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. So let's go ahead and GX harm all his uh, most all the important Pokemon's on his bench line right there. Yeah, once they come off the bench, we can just slap them all. We got a Guzma ready in our hand to knock out all these cards too. So. Giratina, you know, you can come up pretty soon. Really, 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 really soon. Yeah, once the Krasma goes down, go off and finish one of these. Ah, oh, I can't believe it. The combo worked out. This is awesome, awesome. So, what do we do here? We got Guzma now. We can take the first hit. We'll do, we'll, uh, let's see. Uh, you can't take that out. You, this guy can. If I, t t doesn't matter. Well, actually, it does. If the Magnezone goes down, it makes life much harder for him to do stuff. He'll lose a lot of momentum. Because he'll need Mount Coronet to do stuff. Victory! I was <laughs> like, no! All my Pokemon are wounded. I have an easy one-shot coming through with all my Metagrosses. I can fight with Giratina. I think, uh, yeah, he's... you can see that. At that point, very confident. Very, very confident uh, what I have there. So, unfortunately, it wasn't a full match. We got a full one, big full one coming up for you next. Gardevoir, so... Yeah, yeah, this is gonna mess up my intro a bit, because... I'd actually... This is a bonus, bonus match. So, so let's, uh, let's keep moving on. But welcome to another. This is the Necrozma Giratina, but we are able to pull off our... What are we pulling off? 
Metagross, Dark Ride kind of stuff. Hey, Metal Weakness. I might be able to take care of that, although I'm afraid of a Guzma. I'm going to play my remix of this is... Oh, it's a something. It's a song of something. From The Legend of Zelda. Ocarina of Time. That's all we're saying. Here we go. Yeah, I'm going to bridge it. You're all going to be Metagrosses. Energy right here. We need to charge up a Pokemon. Oh, that was... Okay, I only have three Metagrosses left. I kind of want to even charge the Beldum up so I can fight. But I'm afraid of... I'm afraid of... Uh, I'm not really afraid, but... I really gotta get it out. Let's see. Banana Master, I think you always should be here. It's got a choice. Necrozma? Let's go ahead and use Legendary Guidance. Get those uh, energies up on here. Yeah, and you can get metal energies on here too. And then use weakness damage to take care of the Metagross. Alright, so I'm using Mew instead of Vulpix here. Okay. Big ol' Levy? That's right. That is definitely the song in the chat. So, you heard it, then you know it. You know it. You know what it is. Guzma brings up the Beldum, tries to... Oh, he's just using it to switch. Beacon, get the get, get those glasses set up there. Alright, so we'll Cynthia. We're going to hope for some rare candies. We want the candies. That's it. Uh, okay, I want the candies. Here we go. Give me the candies. Give me the Metagrosses. Candy and Metagross. Bingo. See, I have an energy in this card, don't I? So this can be retreat energy if I need somebody to start up front. I do need a retreat energy, so send me back up there. Alright, you want to throw Banana Master down, Donald? Or do you want to throw the Giratina down? Oh, Banana Master, I really... You know the right thing to do is Banana Master. Always. Always Banana Master. Oh, I could have used this to retreat. That's okay leaving that, that there. Legendary Guidance, Metal Energies onto Metagross. Is be able to abuse weakness damage here. Alright, so we still have two GXs if he gets, you know, all the Metagross. Woo! I don't know. I'm not sure which GX is going to be good. Taking a long way up there. We have to. We want to be really aggressive, really soon, really, really soon. Spreading, uh, spreading the stuff out. Beacon. I'm using, uh, I'm using Muse for my energies. Yeah, we know that, Donald. Let's get the other two Metagrosses up as well. Yeah, slow, slow, nice, slow game here. Okay, energy on you. There we go. Another one. Unfortunately, I don't have enough. What I don't have uh, anything to be aggressive with, so we're gonna keep using legendary guidance. Any way I like, right? Metal energy goes here. You can have metal energy too. All right. Come on, get your get your uh, get your uh, those guys up. Yeah. Okay. Now we can get some... Nope, not GX value just yet. Guzma! Give me the first hit. Yeah, give me the give me the big, big, big first hit on this. No, oh, what do you think the next... What do you think of the next set? It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. I don't see anything too, 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 too crazy just yet. It's making the bad, better decks like Buzzwall even better. You need to make Buzzwall better? Sure. Sure. Yeah, we do. We're both looking for Guzmas until we get both at the first hit. It's there's only two GX there. I'm gonna wait till at least next turn to even fight with the Krasma. I can get the rescue stretcher, get that back, but or maybe I we just fight right now. Yeah, let's go ahead and fight now. 
Hang on. I'll start the fight. Activate Geotech systems. Grab that on there. Giga Hammer. I'm not giving you any more time. All right, take that. Professor Sycamore? Yeah, it's a supporter. I right? have something I can play. Let's see. Preferably, if he overloads his Gardevoir too much, maybe we can get some value. So this comes up right here. Can he get a one-shot? It's going to be difficult, but for sure I'll have a one-shot coming back soon. So I'll be okay. And if we that, I do lose it, I can rescue a treacher back. Let, several Pokemons are ready to go. Um, let's see. Let's hope that it survives. DCE? Yeah, pay up everything to get the KO on this. To get the one shot. Alright. Do I have more to fight back with? Maybe, maybe not. Let me see. Which Metagross is this? One that reused Rare Candy to evolve. We'll probably rescue Stretcher, but directly back into the deck unless I can pull something real nice here. Let's see, how many energies do I need to take out this? I think, let's see, one more energy is necessary. Uh, I have 190, yeah, we need one more energy here to take it out. So we gotta get another, yet another Metagross going in the meantime. Infinite Force, enough to take it out. This time I'm gonna trade now. Well, I have, I can wait the damage here. I have Metagross here, this here, so it's gonna be easier for him to get a KO on this. But after I take that last card out, it might be okay. Let's see, we have an Ultra Ball. I want to keep that, uh, something else here. Matang. Hey, buddy. Make sure I have this ready to go soon. We'll rescue Stretcher. We're gonna do the shuffle, okay? Because I need these guys back. Oh, you might need a Lele, too. You're gonna regret not being the Ultra Ball Lele for the win if you do that, Donald. Yeah. Yeah, pull some extra cards down. Probably not with Professor Sycamore in your hand, because you're gonna pull better grass, it's like, it's life sucks. Is there any chance you can get two Metagrosses out? I think so. Let me see. Do you wanna attach an energy or do you wanna activate the effect? Activate the effect, of course. Easier that way. Make sure you're ready to fight, because you are my next fighter. And the last bench space, we're gonna save it open. Actually, no, it's gonna it's gonna we're gonna lose the Necrozma, so. Prismatic Burst. Take that down. All energies go. There's no energies on me, so he can't use it for retreat. I've got Guzma to help me retreat, on the other hand, though. However, you know, it's pretty easy for God of War to go. Alright, so, yeah, you can't use my energy for damage here. What about you, Giratina? You want to show up? Oh, I guess I just took the bench base for that. Never mind, Giratina, you already had your day with that Hitmong Chad. He's like, I'm not ready. Well, I'm ready for you, buddy. I got one prize card, uh, three three left. Yeah. Uh... Okay, next turn we get two Metagrosses. We might be able to rare candy next one, but I probably have to play the Guzmas next turn. Choice Man trying to, if he squeezes everything on this Gardevoir, that's gonna be it. I'll take it out. You're putting everything on it, huh? Okay, now you gotta switch. This may be a Lele into an N. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm gonna, I'm, I'm definitely abusing the, the metal weakness here. Okay. Guzma incoming says full pie. Hello, full pie. That would stink. But does he have enough damage? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, he does. If he takes out the Metagross, I won't be able to charge up as quickly. So I would have to use Mew or yeah, Mew to maybe uh, get some stuff out. No, I wouldn't be able to do that. Rare Candy, another Guard of War coming, so that's plan B. It's gonna be N instead of, uh, yeah, stuff. So, good for me. I lose my, uh, unfortunately, mm, 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 not good. My turn again, okay. Perfect. He got really unlucky then. This is a big move for you. Geotech, that metal energy back. It's already holding on to something I need. 
I could just Ultra Ball this out. You know, I am. I'm gonna Ultra Ball this, get another Metagross ready. Pull more with Banana Master here. Do I got any more Metal Energies in my deck? Nope, you have no energies in your deck. Okay, charge this guy up then. Game. He put everything all in into that Gardevoir to get the one shot to get Guzma. But he didn't. Something got stuck in that line. And I have Metal Weakness, so... We got it. GG. We got it. We got it, we got it. Sorry, Giratina. Um, you, you have your own match in this video here, so... Welcome to another Metagross ne Necrozma with the new uh, Giratina. That's a lot of cards. So, let us get started. I'm going to play my remix of Kazuna Uta from Tales of Vestria. Okay, you don't belong on front. I'm going to be greedy, okay? What greed? What kind of greed are you talking about, Donald? I'm going to play Professor Sycamore my first move. However, since I have an energy in my hand, I actually want it in the discard, not into a Pokemon. Actually, I do want it onto a Pokemon. I want it into my Mew. All right. Let me read that in a bit. Let me fo fo finish off my turn here. Eh, he might have a DC and just one-shot me up. I'll better leave it up front. I do have a Float Stone right here. So I'm okay. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for my either my Prism Star here, Tina, or my Necrozma with this Mew right here. It's only 30 hit points, so if you're running into a buzz wall, that's it. Had a DCE right here, so if I sent it up front, yeah, you did. Or you can just do that. Thank you for the bits, the Ace of Spades. I just had to watch my Mew die off the bat for free like that, so... We're gonna end. Shrink his hand just a little bit, even though he probably had a bad hand there, but. Uh, well, what do you do? Ooh, Professor Sycamore, don't you discard, discard my Metagrosses? That ain't cool. Well, we're only discarding one Metagross, so it's okay. So, a bit slow here, but we'll have. Yeah, it's very, very slow here today. But. Alright, Mewtwo. Hitmonchan is here too. What? It's 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 all the original cards. It's really a Hitmonchan deck. Really? Why do you have those DC here? It's like because I can use it. Random receiver. Found a found a draw supporter. So it's like a kind of a pseudo burst seeker, but not really. It does thin the, your deck of supporter. What? What? Two Guzmas? No way, man. Punk. All right, well, this guy doesn't really want me to set up at all. We can see that, Donald. You probably have to use this for a trait, because that's how it works. Your float stones are going to come, Donald. We're not going to let them come. All right, so here's my main Pokemon. We can... Yeah, Giratina, you can deal with these guys here. At least I can start attaching energies to you. It'll be worth it. Probably should, uh... Alright, that's that. I can't... Uh, yeah, I can Algorithm GX. I can attach energies to myself, but now I'll just use this for our retreat next turn. Alright, I hope you have an end to deal with my algorithm. Here we go. I see two rare candies, so I'm grabbing these two. Who gets the last bench space? Unfortunately, I don't have room for you, uh, Necrozma. Letters. Have a Cynthia for next turn, too. Okay, maybe it might not be so bad to start off with the algorithm. Yeah! Alright, you got two Guzmas, you hunted down my Mew, you brought out my Metagross. What else can you do to me? Do you have an end here? But this isn't a really, uh, this isn't, well, it's good old Hitmonchan and, and Mew. 60? Ah! Alright! Rare Candy. Rare candy again. Energy right here. I can't algorithm unless I switch. 
Wait, I only have enough energies here. I can't attack yet. I can't attack yet. I can get two energies on, but that's about it. I'm not ready to do that. So I have to take another hit right now. Yeah, I didn't need the leather. If I retreat... If I retreat, I can only attach two energies on, so that's about it. So that's not gonna fly. We're gonna go for some more extra cards right now. Another rare candy? Almost another Metagross. Alright, that's it right there. So, you saw like, I got an army of the original art cards. These probably are in my, uh, in my, in my closet right now, too. How come you didn't rare candy, uh, Metagross before you play N? Did I? Did I have that? If I had that, I, I missed it. I missed it. Alright, so, it's beating up a Metagross, he's, he's going home now. Giratina. It's time for you to go for it. Uh, let's see. I don't think I need to, to even attach any energies on this guy. I can just hold my hand right now. Get to work. Alright. Oh, we... I don't have psychic weakness to that guy, luckily. Here we go. Crisis Drive against a poor Hitmonchan. 300 damage due to weakness. One prize card. Alright, we're even. That's for taking out my Mew. Yeah, I would have Mewed out my Giratina and uh, charged it up. Alright, maybe I should have put a blend of maybe even metal energies, although... You know, it might work. It might work. We'll just only use like four metal energies or something. Psychic. He's not been able to play any draw supporters here. We see that, Donald. We see that. Everything's good in my hand? I don't have another Pokemon to charge up on the bench. That Beldum is taking the bench space. Alright, but at least I have continuous fire with Giratina. Crisis Drive again! It's like this is my short, short, short moment to do something all good here. Alright, now the big Hitmonk Chan comes out. He's like, hello, I'm Hitmonk Chan. Where's Hitmonk Lee? It's like, you know, a more popular Hitmonk Lee. Hitmonk Lee came in the fossil editions, but, uh, oh well. Oh, there's Dragonite too. I'm. Super Dildo's like, this is all Generation 1. I will not play any other, uh, anything else. Still, still hanging in there. Perfect. Well, keep going. I think this is last, this is definitely his last turn here before uh, we have to bring uh, the big guns out. Crisis Drive. It's your moment today, man. All right. The Crosmas? This is your main attacker, Donald? Yep, yep. Is there a good basic? There's Mewtwo. You can use a GX there. I suppose. Mewtwo comes out, it's like, I'll handle this. Now let's see, he's got he's spent a lot of energy so far. Is he he might be really, really stuck. Yeah. It's like, alright, in that case, you live! Keep going. Oh, I attached an energy. I didn't need to do that. I could just keep recycling. Crisis Drive, another prize card. With the Choice Band, I can take out the the, the Dragonite too. It's Hitmonk Drew here. Hi, oh hi, Hitmonk Drew in chat. Hitmonk Champ comes like, oh yeah, I just see a fighting energy. I'm gonna jab it. Gotcha. The reign of Giratina's over. Pokedex. He's old school cool, and I like that Super Deal though. What, do you, what does this do? This is still in the game. Look at the five next five cards. Put them any way you like. Old school cool uh, super dildo. Dido. Oh my gosh. I'm... What'd you say, Donald? What'd you say? Ah, uh, I'm out of this. My brain, my brain, my brain, my brain, my brain, you know. This is, this is really, uh, really dirty and off. So I read that wrong, and uh, let me see this guy. He's old school, generation one cool. No draws though, so we had it easy. We definitely had it easy this time. But I like your style. I like your style. Uh, Super Dino. Gotcha. Got it. 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 Moving. On. Welcome to another. So now, welcome to another Metacross match. Yes, today's uh, giveaway winner on stream is Neg Wars. Yes, hello Neg Wars. Congratulations. So let us get started. I'm fortunately I won the coin flip. 
We try to evolve, get this going. He is playing uh, Execute. And, oh, it's an ex Executor. Alolan Executor decks. All right, here we go. Let me play, a, a, you know, remix befitting up between our match. This is Action Battle from Xenoblade Chronicles 2. That was good. So. All right, no, you need a draw supporter or a Bridget. Tour Bubble, that can take the... Well, I'm gonna need a Banana Master to come back. Energy, you do want energies in the discard starting off. Got a Mew. Don't got any draw supporters, so we want to be able to thin our hand as much as possible. You know, since I can start evolving this, I better get it down. I won't be able to dr drop my hand as much. You know what? We're dumping this, because I want the extra card pulls. I'm going to pull out a Bulbasaur. Put this down right here. One extra card pulls. Give me my draw. So give me my stuff. Stop it, please. I guess, but I have to discard a Metagross line. It might be worth it, though. There we go. Terrible first move, but that's what you gotta do. It's what you gotta do. Executor is up. Bulbasaur is like, Executor wants to use his continuous egg explosion or something. So, energy here. He did have a draw supporter as well. I can't discard stuff my cards. It hurts. It hurts. Yes, you can, Donald. You must. You must discard it. Sophocles! Alright. That works. Get another, uh, get another of you guys going. I still need that actual draw, still. I don't think I want to put that on the bench. I definitely want to um, build them. We'll go ahead and set you down, too. I don't have any cards, I know, but Banana Master, you can still get me another pull. Right now, the Guzma's like, that we really want to be here, Donald, but I don't need you guys here. Okay, that is it for now. I have to leave it up front. I think I'm okay leaving it up front. You know, it's a retreat. I, I have to find another retreat if I retreat it now, so... Alright, we're getting Guzma, Sophocles, Guzma again, Skyla, none of our big draw supporters yet, but he's got none so far, so I'm in a I'm in a much better spot than he is. Yeah, so Bridget, Bridget's there. Yeah, we could Ultra Ball G well, I guess we could have Ultra Ball G at the start. Okay, well. Let's go ahead and get this up here. Metagross, go ahead and come up too. Yeah, so that that setup. Definitely, definitely. I'm in a better position here. If I have an end, let's end. Another Metagross here. Bye, Goosebuzz. Don't show up at the start, man. Put a Pokemon back from your discard onto this. Alright, rare candy. Get this guy up. What do we got here? Metal energy. Geotech systems. Metal energies. Geotech systems. Oh, algorithm. I don't think I want an algorithm. Yeah, you can get another Metagross up. That'd be cool. Algorithm GX. Metagross. Rare candy. N. Energy. Leave that bench space open. Got draw supporters everywhere. All right, there we go. I'll be very, very set up, but I'm gonna end. I'm gonna end to get me more cards, of course. And he has one more chance to get this guy home, but that is a big, big trade cost. It's heavy into the other stage too. It's Executor's up. All right. Heavy ball that's going for a Venusaur. Okay. No energies. Ah. Yeah, you are. I see the brick. That's why I'm trying to unbrick you. There. Nope, nope. He's got it. Finally. He is free. Get a retreat. Go home. Catch up. Because, ah, uh, you know, I don't really like to play against bricks. You know, one way it's either I brick, my opponent bricks. It's not as cool. But things are getting, you know, I think it's catching up very nicely now. 
Because this is looking dangerous. Dangerous, 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 dangerous. Get an IV Sword, second fight, IV Sword. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm starting to feel pressured now. Now I'm looking at that stuff right there, and he's starting to, like, I can come back now. Finally, my first draw of support the Sycamore. Suddenly, his whole entire bench is filled. So, what do you do, Donald? Sad face. Something bad happened. He couldn't find a Venusaur, or they're all prized up. All right. Energy here, float stone here. I'm gonna have to play Professor Sycamore for end right now because I want some of the energies in the discard for myself. I know my Metagross is surprised up. I gotta save that last retreat for when I really need a retreat. So uh, let's go ahead and use Giga Hammer. Take the KO on the Ivy Sword. It looks like he couldn't find an Ivy Sword with that too. So let's go ahead and take that out. Rare candy. Unfortunately, I know that the last Metagross is prized up, so that's why that's not going out right now. Can I get the Giratina going? I can't attack, so I probably would try to get the Giratina going. Two energies. Mm, yeah, yeah, you almost. You need another energy, so you won't be able to attack next turn. All right, bind time. This is gonna be, probably gonna be lately for something for a draw because this hand is getting really, really low here. It's going to be Banana Master for the extra pool, so there's no Lele here. Da, da, da. Super Rod, getting those Eevysaur, the Ivysaur line back as well, and going to be able to pull three more cards. And if he lands a draw, it's a border. Banana Master, you know, I trust Banana Master. You do amazing things. Share the love with Banana Master. Three more cards. Come on, draw us a border. Get, to, get the Ivysaur up. There it is. He's like, I'm ready. Watch out, Donald. I'm going to coin flip the victory if you, I get this. And you threw away all your Guzma, so you won't have... You gotta be really, really careful. Really, 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 really careful. You know what? I have an idea. I've got a plan. I've got a plan. I can't attack now. I don't have enough energy. Yeah, I do. I do. I have three Metagrosses. What are you saying? But you don't have three energies in the discard. That's the problem. You only have two energies in the discard. You have to discard another energy, and that's not possible right now, Donald. It's No, it's not. Therefore... Get some value out of this guy here. I don't want to end him for any reason. He doesn't need the extra cards now. Things are getting a little crazy for me. I don't want to help him out at the moment. I did earlier, but let's keep going. Get Be ultra prepared for the future, Mr. Fan. The float zone kind of messes up the Metagross because I can't retreat and unload all my energies. So, yeah, a little problem there. Be careful with your float stones. Don't do that. Send out a little tiny Mew here. So, I won't have any Guzmas. And he's looking for that Venusaur. I might be prized up. It might be prized up. But, you know, with that pull, he had an Ultra Ball there, too. Uh, Venusaur, you coming? He was like, um, no, we're still here. He's like, oh, but I'll take a prize card and get that Venusaur out to discard. That's probably what he's going. I'm gonna put a hard face, break face too. Wish baton. He looks like the Venusaur is prized up. For two of them. Likely. I don't know. He's ready to fight with this. Okay, gonna go ahead and retreat. He needs one head, one head to kill a Mew. Mew has the lowest amount of hit points that any other Pokemon can have, so... Uh, yeah. Can't you attack infinitely with Metagrosses? Uh, no, I can't use Giga Hammer twice. And then I have to, well, change the combo there. Okay, so I have a free retreat. We're gonna go into battle right now. 
throw you up in there. Giga Hammer. Get two hit KO on this. Almost damage. Almost enough damage. You don't have a Necrozma here though, Don Don. Yeah, all the bench space. Taken. Take it up. Now I can retreat and attack. Yeah, the 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 the, the floats don't messed up my infinite combo. He's got a counter energy, but counter energy does not work in Pokemon GX. So going through his deck still, 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 still with its with this energy here. Okay, it's not prized up. I feel like you know there there were so many cards I could help uh, pull it out sooner. So now that energy is now a double double grass energy. He's got three energies. He's gonna have to attack with Tropical Hedge. Sixty damage to somewhere. Yeah, yeah. So ev everybody's caught up at this point. Yeah, everybody's caught up. This is a full full deal. Why is this full by? Yeah, well, he was a little baby last time, so I need to, 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 to bring him home. So if he attacks, I don't know. He might take the meal for the prize guards. And he took away the float stone, so that's not an issue anymore. Baby Mew, you dead? I was like, yes, Donald, I can see that. I am dead. So now, we're going to go ahead and use the little infinite thing, or we could try to get our Necrozma out. You know, it's only 30 damage, Donald. I haven't pulled the Metagross out of my d stuff yet. I don't want to mess myself up. The Metagross... I know you're not there, Metagross, right? Yeah. Let's take a look at the remaining of the deck. Eight cards left of my deck. They're not really anything I should have. Guzma's prized up too, Donald. Guzma is prized up too. Retreat with this guy. Giga Hammer. Finish that off. All right. Take that out right there. One, two prize cards, fortunately. There's that final Metagross. All right. Yeah, well, it's there. Ends helping not deck out. And Rare Candy. Good deal. Good deal. Three energies. That's a lot of coin clips. This is going to hurt, man. It going to hurt. You got to get a two removal. Oh, you don't. You already used the two removal. That no good. That's no good. I'm gonna play an N right there. All right. He'll get a KO on this, probably, likely. That's six coin flips. That is six coin flips. I am definitely, definitely scared now. Big, big, big time. Big, 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 big time. I probably should have sent this Metagross out instead. Because I won't have enough energies to attack. That's too many tails. He's gonna flip again. Yeah. Come on, 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 come on. Oh, that was enough. That no good. I'm in trouble. I lost that final metal. Gr yeah, I really should have charged up a fresh one. Uh oh. I need another energy. I need another energy. I all my goosebumps are gone. This is about to be over for me, guys. Hang on. Send you out. I still can get another Metagross up, at least two. There's some energies left in my deck. Hang on, there might not be another energy in my deck. Yeah, there is, there is, there is. Send this out. Cynthia. If I have the energy, I can attack. If, if I don't, I lose. I, I may potentially lose another Metagross. I don't. I don't have another. Didn't pull that one of those two energies with the Cynthia. It was a uh, kind of a good chance, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I should have sent out. Metagross had no energies, but I'll have it. I sent the one that had three energies to attack to get continuously. All right, Neg Wars. He's got, he's got going four energies. Like it's all in. I get to keep all my energies anyways. I think he got me, guys. So. Yep, my energy, my energy. I'll have another Metagross, but still, I'll still need another Enderman energy. Tails, tails. How many heads does he need? He needs four heads. Wow, that is a lot of tails. So yeah, you flip again. Now there's gonna be a lot of heads. Four heads. Three, four. There we go. I can't get any energies on my guys. 
Yeah. Well, this is it. Good game, I think. Unless he gets lots of tails. Uh, better grass. I can't even have. I don't have enough energy to charge this up. Could I have? Could I have played better and managed my energies better? Yep. Always. Always. And let's make sure. Uh, well, I don't know. There's still a lot of stuff there. There's no more Guzmas left, so I couldn't. I wouldn't be able to go for the Venusaur to shrink his energy downs. All right, that is that. It's like I just need three, three heads, four heads, four heads to win. All right. This is it. Get that fourth, fifth energy in there and go. If not, yeah. Well, you don't know. You never know with this game. We saw the horrifics about the tails before. So, Draco Media Barrage. Those tails are adding up. Well, flip again. Vic Denny is like, I got you, bro. I got you. I'm alive. But I have one more damage, I die. So I have no idea what to do with that. It's game. Yeah, it's game. I should have charged up the fresh Metagross and kept the one with the energies back. That was the deal. That was the deal. So, he'll get to pass three energies. All the Guzmas and tool removals were at the start of the deck. I wouldn't be able to remove this. I only have one because this deck uh, this deck eats up a lot of space. It's going up. I don't trust the coin flips. Lele comes out. Perfect. Perfect. Good game, Net Wars. Now, you know for sure you will win this. So, this is GG. This is GG. You need a Sycamore and lose. Don Bay, you're such a jerk. Don Bay, he's, he's, he's ruined for the underdog, so it's cool. Good game, good game. Okay. Well, you made it to the end. Thank you, congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. Metagross GX, I suppose you too, Giardina. Let's rate you. Let's break it down. Unique trait. What is the biggest thing this deck can do that others cannot? Geotech system. The ability to regenerate energies and, you know, make energies obsolete. You're always going to get energies once you get Metagrosses going. Several Metagrosses going. Five out of five, because it brings out certain cool, cool, powerful combos that other decks can't do. Damage. Four out of five. Nobody really has big damage except one card. This guy. Prismatic Verse. Oh, yeah. Lots of damage. Black Ray hurts everything. So he's a... Uh, just because of this guy that there's damage. That's something other Metagross's deck can't do, so that's what makes it special. Very important card. Uh, four out of five still, because everybody else is a two shot. Yeah. All right, so the one shot. Okay, we got it, we got it. Set up, we're gonna give it a three out of five. This whole deck eats up a lot of, you know, potential deck space, because you gotta get max rare candies, you have to have lots of deck there, so you can, uh, w through chance, through RNG, set up these Metagrosses. You need to set up these Metagrosses to get them going, and it takes a while. You don't need, like, just one, you need several, and that is, you know, risky. Yeah, that's why you put it, it is risky. We're 3 out of 5 for sure for that. Defense, 4.5. Extra? You don't have any max motion, which there should be one. However, while making the deck, I need to set up. So once, you know, I can home out maybe one or two cards I can take out for max motion. Uh, and get that through. But defense, by the way, 250 maximum hit point any GX can have. You also trading through is maybe some one prize guard Pokemons. And it's it's gonna take your opponent a little bit extra effort to finish your Pokemon off in time. So a little bit just a tiny bit extra. 0.5. Yeah, full five is something else. It could be there with the max potion. Five five, that's that. So rating, it's enjoyable. I'm gonna put my, some of my feelings in there. Yeah, we'll put it with a B minus. Definitely the faster decks would probably be able to pick it apart. It really does want to fight against Espeon, who will undervolve all these Metagrosses here too. But we'll talk about that in weakness. So B minus, it's all right. Trading off max potion power for a bit of damage here. The hybrid version. Yeah, so that's the biggest thing. Regular Metagross build, just use full metal, use the new Necrozma. I'm sorry, yeah. Uh, Dust Mace, Sogolio Necrozma. 
and you have something similar without having to you know, try to make it clunky through two different techs here. You just don't get the cool black ray tree X. So, I don't know. I have to try both to find out which is better. But for now, it's all right. It is a B minus. Weaknesses. Where are the weaknesses? If something happens to your abilities, the whole thing falls apart. So, Garbador shuts off abilities. You don't want to fight that. You better try to get rid of it as quick as you can through a Guzma or something. Yeah. So, that is about... Yeah, about that. That's the major weakness. Anything that shuts this down is going to get you. All right, upgrades. I'm gonna try to squeeze some max potions somewhere because it is very compatible. However, everything here is just for setup, setup, setup because you know you gotta make it consistent. So one or two max potions somewhere, one card you choose. You've got to upgrade that. Even it'll make a difference. One max potion is an extra turn of Pokemon stays in battle. So what one card could that be? Maybe. Maybe. Okay, so we'll leave it at that. All right, what not all? What is up for next time? All right. Ah, this is a pretty nice deck. You know what? Let's get the. We're gonna do some strong. Uh, we're gonna do another strong deck. We're gonna go for. I don't need to find out what the best grass deck is now, and I think it might be this car. Yeah. Tapu Bulu. We'll, uh, we'll go back and revisit you. Because I need, well, strong grass sticks. There are two of them. I want to see how they are currently in the meta. So uh, that's up for next time. Yeah, a nice, solid, consistent build with that. All right, so that is it for now. Time to wrap this up. Thank you, and of for Frenchals. Please like, subscribe, because I got more good things coming for you soon. Uh, follow me on social media. They'll give you clues when new things are happening. My uh, remixes can be found on iTunes, Spotify, Wherever you like to stream music, they're going to be there. All right, so uh, Discord link is right on the ceiling. And if you can't see that, it's right above my head. So, that's it for now. Thank you, Unagrosal Frenchals. Take it easy. Stay safe. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.